So now we're coming on to our maze design. Now you will need your original plan for this. Don't forget to have that with you at all times. So now we've made our first Sprite Explorer. I'm gonna put him just down in the corner here, which is gonna be the starting position for his uh, maze. Now, I need to draw the maze. I'm designing my maze. So I'm using the design that I've made um, and I'm going to try and copy it into Scratch. Now for that I need to go to the stage area and if I click on backdrops you will see I've got the same three tabs up here, code um, and sounds, but instead of costumes it now says backdrops. And now I can go into here and just like I did with my sprite I can start drawing my backdrop. Now it's going to be a very simple maze so I'd like to use uh, some black walls and I'm going to use the straight line tool and I'm going to make it a little bit thicker, uh, maybe 20, and I'm going to start to draw my maze. Now, copying my design as best as I can, I'm going to use the straight line tool to start drawing some lines on here. Here we go, and I need to make sure that the sprite is going to fit down in between them. Okay, so let's go with this and see if we can get uh, a really good idea of how this is going to look. It's about there. There we go. Okay, so now we've got all our walls in place, we need to have our finishing spot. Now I'm going to choose a circle tool here to get my finishing gold spot. I just need to try and find a colour that looks a little bit like gold. There we go. And I'm going to plonk the circle up here. Ah, now it did a black outline, so I'm going to go back in and change that to say no outline. There we are. Brilliant. Okay, so I have my maze and I have my finishing spot. And we're ready to start coding. <laughs> 